Well, if you're watching this, it means today went better than yesterday. What's going on, everybody? My name's Brian, you're watching Alien Anarchy, and the sun is terrible. I, I can't even see my face on the screen here, so hopefully you guys can. But uh, we, and when I say we, my friend Nathan and I are on a little Northwoods adventure. We are floating a river, which is what we did yesterday, and got our butts thoroughly kicked. We did I, a lot of floating. We did, we did so much floating. <laughs> so We're really floating, good at floating. So good at it. Uh, and getting a sunburn even though we put sunscreen on. Anyway, uh, we are taking another stab at this. We went a little further up the river that we're trying to fish to find a little bit of cooler water. Yesterday we had anywhere from 72 in the morning to 75 in the afternoon. Right now we're staring down the barrel of 70 with some clearer water. Um, this is getting close to some trout water actually. So we've got some cooler water to work with. This is a very skinny river so uh, not much room to work with, but uh, we did see two muskies yesterday that followed baits. Was yeah. one? Yeah, it was a good one. It was a good one. So we're hoping to build upon that. We saw two yesterday. Let's see if we can do better than that today. <laughs> and let's get fishing. All right, boys and squirrels, uh, since we're fishing pretty tiny small water, we are using tiny smaller baits than usual. Uh, I've got a whopper plopper on. Um, throwing it on a nine foot surgical strike still though with 80 pound fins and a nice little light trophy time leaders and lures. Hit up Trevor Allen for those uh, leader for this smaller bait. What's Nathan got? He's got a wrong-handed tranks as per usual. And what do we got there? This is called a headbanger. Headbanger, people. Basically a skitter walk with a isolated bill. Okay. Well, we'll see what uh we'll see what these will do for us because uh I don't know if you can see, but it's a lot of this. It's, uh really shallow with a lot of grass, so getting any sort of bait other than a topwater through this as of right now anyway until we get to some deeper water is going to be tough. So, that's the program for right now. We'll see what uh, Cedar does for us. There's a fish. Muskie. Take it. Right there. Good fish. I never saw him. He was following it. He was following it? Yep. How big? 34. Okay. Yep. Clear as day. He's kicked off right there. Alrighty. Wasn't shallow enough to wake it, but sure. He was there. He was behind it. Yep. Oh, I saw him clear as day. One hundred percent of musky. Okay. Well, that's good. First sighting of the day. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh, dude, bro, what was that? Get on him. Get him. Yeah. <laughs> Man, you're just skipping minnows. Yeah. Oh, 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 no. <laughs> I felt the weight too. No. <laughs> he had a hook in him. Did he? Yeah. I felt the weight. It came out. Dude. Wow, he was tight to shore, wasn't he? Yep. Nope, he missed my bait. He missed my bait. All 
Are you kidding me? I put it right on when he missed it. Get in there. Okay. Are you kidding me? I got you. How is he that jazzed up and now he won't come back? Water. Little midday update. We are still getting our butts kicked. Although we've seen, what, maybe four fish now. Nate had a follow. We've seen, we just saw a fish chasing bait and I've dropped that little uh, single eight boiler maker right on top of it. And it like bounced the bait out of the water. I never felt a thing. Like, and Nate had one blow up on the whopper plopper. Yeah, we hook. can just not catch a muskie. It's just enough to save sand. It's like, I don't know. It's starting to go crazy here. But uh, we've got some clouds building. Uh, feels like we've got a cloud or a sky full of clouds and not a single one is over us. Um, we could certainly use that because we are roasting out here. There's a little bit of a breeze, thankfully. But uh, gosh, we need to catch a muskie so bad. <laughs> Hopefully. Hopefully the next time I'm talking to you, it's with one of these dumb things in the net. Let's, fingers crossed. Now this isn't the worst. Well, I didn't catch anything on opener other than that little guy. No, this, this is definitely the worst, Nathan. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, you. Oh, are you kidding me? Stop it. God, Stop never it. had it. We can't win. Oh my god. <laughs> you seem like a good fish too. Get him. I mean we're seeing him. <sighs> yeah, at least yeah. It's action. My goodness. There it is. Oh, he missed it. <gasps> oh, no! He had it. He had it. <laughs> Dude, we're cursed today. Like, wow. That's crazy. He had it down. I know, yeah, yeah. How big a fish? A nice swirl. <laughs> oh, my God. Do you feel them? Oh, there we go. Yeah. Oh, that's a pike? Do you want to net him? No. Okay. Do you think that was what hit you before? I don't know. That was about 20 feet to the left of him. That's a pretty fish, though. Yeah. All right, just in case we don't catch anything else today. We have had everything smacking us. Man, look at that thing, though. That's First thing we put in the boat. <laughs> that is a dark pike, man. It is. I thought it was a muskie at first. Yeah. Oh, there he goes. Nice. Well, hey, we caught something. Yay. Is it pike? Oh man, that's not terrible. Yeah, it is. Yeah. 
mean, we're the only people that are really disappointed with a nice bite. <laughs> I'm just going to fucking wash. Probably. Fish, yeah, it is. Push 30. See you. Nice. <sighs> Almost. <laughs> We got thunder rumbling. Yeah. <sighs> this is a lot of work for two, what, three pike now? Yeah. <sighs> We've seen three legit muskies today. Yeah. But yeah. we've had some blow ups that were definitely bigger fish. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's okay. We got storms in the background. <laughs> it's fine. There's no need to panic yet, but almost. All right. Let's see if we can get one. Dude, that's a good one. Can't see him. That pushed a lot of water though. Yeah, it did. Can't see him. Dude, that water's so dark. Yeah. That was. Yeah. I saw that weight come off that edge. It just came off the edge. Yep. I can't see him though. Huh. Yeah, a bunch of weight. Yeah. <laughs> Have you ever had one of those days of musky fishing that's just so fun and so action filled that you just don't want it to end? This is not that day. This is more the the setting sun is mercifully putting us out of our misery and we get to go eat food type of days. <sighs> My goodness. Two days I've caught a fish in two days, Nathan. Yeah. Yeah. My goodness. I mean at least uh, today was better than yesterday. Yesterday was a rough going. Um, but at least we were seeing some fish moving around today. We caught a couple of pike, saw some muskies, but my lord. Um, just enough to tickle your fancy. Yeah, it tickled something, that's for sure. <laughs> oh my goodness. I, the only thing that I'm looking forward to right now is, uh, quite honestly, a beer or more than that probably, uh, and a steak. So uh, we're going to do that. We are trying to figure out what to do tomorrow. Uh, we sort of put all, I don't know if we really put all our eggs in one basket, but we were hoping this river would, would kick out some fish. Uh, we've got some lakes that we can drive to. We might do that. I don't know. I don't know. But we've got two days left, so something needs to happen. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, we are going to go strategize for tomorrow, try to get some rest. And do this all over again so uh if you made it this far i appreciate it and uh yeah this is musky fishing it does not always go the way you want to go uh so yeah with that i appreciate you watching this mess and i'll see you on the next video